Right, so I asked on Instagram the other day, what should I do on this channel? And some people said they liked the, um, in the live kind of, where did this go? Oh, there's a cat. Day in a live kind of vlog, so that's what I'm doing today. First thing I like to do in the mornings is go around and try to find, um, the geckos. As you can see, Lyra is there. She is definitely liking her snake plant at the moment. I'm not sure where the Chihuahua is. He keeps hiding in here though. It's like planter. It used to have a plant in it, then the plant died, and it's really difficult to plant anything in. I said plant loads of times, but he keeps sleeping in there lately, and I literally can't get to him. Also, look at my socks. They're amazing. Look at this little tootsie! The harvester ants spend the whole night getting rid of all their rubbish. I've been filming time lapses on them because they've been quite interesting lately with some of their food choices. I'm sure you'll see some time in the future. One of the big jobs I need to do today is clean out these guinea pigs and move them into their winter home. Don't I, Ted? Yes. So this is their winter home. I find it always looks smaller on camera, but it is actually pretty hefty. Uh, me and my dad built it. And I think we're going to have quite a hard winter because black breeds came out really early this year, which is normally a sign. So I'm glad to be getting them in right now because it's getting chilly. Okay, that's all done. It doesn't look that interesting at the moment, but I'll move them all in with their stuff when I'm going to feed them this evening. Okay, I'm about to go live on you now. And I'm actually filming my wood lights. But the weird thing is, like, my stream's going to be more about YouTube and all of that sort of stuff. But I never like to be in my videos, so people can watch my wood lights if they like. So we just finished the live stream. And my top ten fans on here is Josh, Josh, Ignazis, Ignazi, Ignazi, Piga, Piga, Irish Raver. Let me go down. Curtis. G R K Ify Robustad. Oh my goodness, I'm so bad at name, like actually saying these. Rust and Daisy and Josh. Josh has been a very popular name on here. So thank you to everyone. And there's obviously ones that go beyond the ten points. So Keenan and Lee and everyone. So I'm gonna put your names right here. Right, we're just going to put the sand bath in for my chinchilla. She's had a bit of a fur issue. What has just dropped in there? A bit of a fur issue of late. Need to clean her out as well today. There you go. If you've ever wondered how a chinchilla takes a bath, it's like this. And this is where we keep the hay. I always get like a bale of hay from the local farm. It's not treated like the stuff in the pet shop, so it's not like dust free or anything, but it lasts longer and it's so much cheaper. And the guinea pigs love it. Good timing because it's raining today, so. I'll move the guinea pig, for goodness sake. <laughs> I'll move the guinea pigs in in a sec. I've been trying to grow seeds in this aquarium and literally none of them have germinated. They're still asleep. <laughs> in about half an hour the UV light is scheduled to come on and it looks like Diego's already positioned himself ready to get a bit of UVB. I absolutely love it when Zig sleeps, she looks so cute. But for this video, I've been trying out my new camera, which is the G7X Mark II. And I have been stood here for ages just trying to get to focus on her face. And I think it's actually now out of focus. Extremely annoying. So all the Gecko UVB lights are coming on now. They come on for two hours in the morning, two hours in the evening. And Zig and Minis are actually connected. Because if we look under here see this wire is connected here so they only need one plug and one timer so that's handy but um, I do actually need to change their light bulbs soon so these are the light bulbs I think they've changed them though I think this is a the new packaging 
And I've got two of the old ones that have bird lamp on them. They're all 8 watt, um, 12 inches, 2% UVB. And um, yeah, you just replace them once a year. And what I tend to do is I wait till it's like Black Friday, most places have sales, and that's when I buy them. I mean, I don't think you get them much cheaper, but you know, it's always good to have a bargain. Also in the Chihua tank, the UV comes on two hours in the morning, two hours in the evening, and in between those times, Jungle Dawn comes on. So obviously now that's off. The UVB's on. Usually you'll find the Chihua like around here, asleep, out on here. But he's not at the moment, he's been very secretive today, I haven't seen him. They're all moved in now, little Dougal, got your chewy thing over there. He'll be moved in for autumn and winter. Yeah. The light has now come on for Diego, I don't know why I said it like that. But his light always comes on a few minutes after the rest. See, even with an albino, I did a video on this, they'll still use a UVB. The fish are in a temporary tank at the moment as I'm sorting out the other tank. Oh. Just gonna feed them. Now to feed these two. Uh, Ted's had a weepy eye lately, and I think it's because he got um, a seed from the hay in his eye. But I've been keeping it clear, and it it is looking better. It was swollen up at first, but it just weeps a little bit. So I put a little stuff in to prevent any infection. But other than that. Hi Dig. I don't know what the deal is with the focus on here today, but yeah, look at Dig all. So we have one food bar that goes upstairs and one that goes downstairs, but both of the guinea pigs are up here at the moment. Watch out, oh, oh. Don't, oh, you're stepping on the food bowl. I'm trying to pop it in. There you go. Enjoying that? <laughs> and this one goes down here with the hay. Now I'm just going to make up some fruit buzz gold by Arcadia. It's a jelly. So you have to add in boiling hot water. This is ridiculous. Look, I'll just spill it. I'm going to do this after filming. But basically, you do that, you mix it up, you pop it in the fridge, take it out so it's room temperature, and then you can feed it. And it's a jelly. I actually did a video for them on their channel so I'll link that if you want to see more about this. She's still here. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Okay it's a lot later on and we have Lyra out. I love her diamond head. <laughs> like it's like right. a- Oh! She <laughs> <on me. laughs> <laughs> on me. Oh! It's like Okay now we have the jelly ready for the Chihua. I'm gonna use my little spoon and uh, see how it goes for this. Mm. You need to move because your tail. Oh, I just put my finger in it. Your tail. Look, your tail's going out the door. Can't be doing that. You see this? Is that, <laughs> oh, that door? Quite the tail. If that door tries to shut. We are losing a tail. Very so. good grip though. <laughs> I just need to move you out. There you go. Go on, jump on the back. Go on. I don't know if he's going to jump, you can tell. Oh. <coughs> I think the best way to end this vlog is with Gizmo's little face. Yeah. Look at your little face. So cute. This time of night, her eyes go really, really black as well. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I hope you've enjoyed today's vlog. Yeah, I know you haven't been in it very much, Giz. But I hope you've enjoyed today's vlog. Thanks for watching, guys, and goodbye.